So guys, I'm sure you've all seen and heard the news as to why I'm not fighting on December the 18th now. Just thought I'd come in here and tell you myself. Um, training camp couldn't have gone any better for me for the first week, two weeks. But then I contracted a bacterial chest infection, which led me go to the gym and just not being able to breathe. You know, I was in my sparring sessions, pad work sessions, whatever it may be, just not being able to breathe and coughing up huge amounts of phlegm all the time. It led me to sleepless nights. And that went on for about four weeks because I had the mindset of I'm going to keep training, I'm going to get through this, I'm going to have the fight no matter what. And four weeks passed and we decided to have a sparring session and I took a little clip to the body and because my body was so weak due to the virus inside of me, I instantly knew something wasn't right. I was throwing up from the pain, I was doubled over. I literally got my bag and went straight to the hospital, straight for an MRI scan and I got the results back the same day and the results uncovered that I had a clean break in my rib. I'm going to insert the picture here so you can see for yourself and had multiple fractures. I still, you know, for the following week thought, do you know what, you'll be fine, I can fight. And then it really, you know, it took down, it took the doctor and my whole team to really say, listen, you've got a broken rib and multiple fractures here, like you can't fight. And even now sitting here filming this video, it hasn't really sank in that I'm not fighting. All my focus is on right now is getting a new fight date set um, and recovering. That's all I can do right now. I can't do anything else apart from get my body right as quickly as possible and look for a new fight date with Jake Paul. There is no other fight that I want out there. That's the fight that I want next. And like I said, guys, I'm just gonna recover now and hopefully we can work out a new date for next year. Finally, guys, I just wanna say a massive thank you to everyone who supported me throughout the whole training camp. Obviously, everyone's gonna have their own opinions about the situation and what they think, but there is nothing when it comes down to it I can do about being medically unfit to fight.